It's about time. I'm waiting for your call. They caused a hell of a mess in Moscow. Was it worth it? Adler managed to get the list of sleeper agent names, despite himself. He's got balls, I'll give him that. Bell did well. Seemingly. But I think that team is getting too comfortable. They're acting like they know who they're dealing with. Perhaps. Turns out, one of those sleeper agents is tied to Operation Greenlight. Theodore Hastings. He's a nuclear engineer based out of Salt Lake City. And you believe Hastings is the one he'll activate? Exactly. Total surveillance is already underway. It's only a matter of time before he leads us straight to Perseus. This is it. The recent movements of Theodore Hastings has led us here. Cuba. Right in our backyard. A vacant government facility in the Cuban countryside has become a hub of activity for Perseus, and the likely location of the stolen nuke. No hmm. doubt Castro allowed it. Twenty bucks to anyone who can bring him down before me. <laughs> Castro or Perseus? Whoever. We're not going to <laughs> move this nuke inside the states. It's time to take down Perseus once and for all. Team, wrap up any unfinished business. Once we strike, there's no turning back. Okay, so no side missions? Woods, don't get any bright ideas over there. Yeah, you've got my sure as shit. Check that out. Decked out with all my specifications? Mm-hmm. Won't find the half-baked rigs here. Let's go. Feels nice. I think I'm ready to ruin someone's day. Okay. What's this one? End of the line. So didn't it, it said wrap up any outfish business. So to me that means what is this? Oh, there's a note. To me, that means you have to do the side missions now, or else you can't do them. The lead agents have been exchange have been exchanging information with the KGB through a series of dead drops. An encoded list of recent drops. What? The lead agents have been exchanging information with the KGB through a series of dead drops. MI6 believes the watch we recovered in the KGB contains an encoded list of recent drops. Let's see what you can decipher. Bearded lady delivered three files. Possible mole suspects in Lubyanka. Rerouting to Zakayev. Strongman given list for new recruits in Parliament. Juggler file recovered, including blackmail on primary targets. Vienna, Austria. Hmm. Okay. He said bearded lady. I don't know who's the suspect though. Can I just play the mission? Let's choose three suspects. What? Afterwards, use the review suspects menu to mark your three suspects. Okay, so let me take a look at this. Let's see if we can try and find out who it is from all this evidence here. So, the wrist drop containing dead drop lists. What is this? So the suspects, what do we got? We got bearded lady, mole suspects in LaBianca, rerouting to Zakaya, Rome, Italy. That guy was in Rome, Rome, Rome. Okay, let me freaking, dude, I gotta pull up a whole fetching document thing here. Rome, who was in Rome? We had Alex. We had Leslie, Alex, Leslie, nope, 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 no, and no. Okay, so it's one of these two for Rome. K 
Okay, and then next, all right, where'd that picture go? We have Strongman, which is Paris. And who was in Paris recently? Nope. No. No. Nope. Okay, last two. Claire. And the other guy, Jim. Claire and Jim. Okay. And then we have Vienna. And for Vienna... Who do we have here? We have... Elena. She was in Vienna. And Aaron. So Harvey Spray isn't anybody? Okay, so we got that one. All right, next piece of evidence. We've got the cassette. The last report from Bearded Lady indicates a vote in Parliament. Hmm. Well, that what about this? That ledger apartment might hold some clues to the lead agent identities. So the Bearded Lady, which is Rome, right? That one was in Poland. Strongman was in France. And this last one was in England. Okay, let's see if any of that matches up. So, Alex or Leslie, one of them was in Poland. Oh, pfft. they're both in Poland. What the freak? So that doesn't do anything. So they're both still suspects. Okay, what about per uh, Claire and Jim? They're both in France? Yeah, they're both in Fetch in France. Oh my gosh. And what about Vienna? They're both in England. Elena and Aaron? They're both in England. Cambridge? Oh, hey. So, the suspect was also in Cambridge, England. And then the other person was who? Elena and Aaron? She was not anywhere in England. So this has to be Aaron. Okay, so that's Aaron. We know who Aaron is. And now let's take a look at the third one. Or maybe not. I don't know what this is. What is this? What about the cassette tape? The last report from Bearded Lady indicates a vote in Parliament is <gasps> Hey! He believes he has enough influence to convince others to side with him. He believes he has enough influence. The concerned she's been monitored. Suggest KGB run interference for her. For her? The juggler is worried he may lose his next election. Recommends active measures against his opponents. Okay, juggler is a dude, so that's Aaron, yes. Uh, the middle one, strong man, is a chick, so that's Claire. And the top one's a guy, so that's Alex. Okay, so it's Alex, Claire, and Aaron. So we have Alex, Claire, and Aaron. Those three, right there. They're suspect. Okay. Dude, let's, okay, let's do a Red Circus. Once you kill Rudnick. Okay, yep, let's do it. Okay. Woods and Mason are going to take point in this. Apparently, Rudnik is lying low in a remote Soviet base in the mountains of Uzbekistan. Not remote enough. We're going to land our boys nearby and pay him a little visit. Let's cut this Perseus sucker down to size. Rudy! 
You'd better be in that base if we came all this fucking way. Command sounded confident. Once we blow the shit out of their radio tower and create a distraction, we'll find out. It's time for a little hide and seek. Operation Red Circus. All right. We're in position. Roger that. There's an airmail package ready for delivery. Just need an address. Go ahead and mark the radio tower for us. Basically, the tower's up above the far reach. Oh, there it is. Coordinates coming your way. Roger. The check is in the mail. Wait for it. Here it comes. Rudnick escapes in 13 minutes. Uh, what the heck? Oh, interact. Here we go. Now we can get down. Touch the line, bro. Let's go, Woods. Skips in 12 and a half minutes. Uh oh. Okay, we gotta search three places motor pool, radar station, and fuel depot. Oh, snap. Oh! Dude, check out that assassination! Okay, next building. Well, I hear a sniper. Rednick escapes. Oh, I was gonna say, I hear somebody with a shotgun. He's gonna be the last building I search, huh? Thank you, Woods. What? Nah. Oh! Yo! Dude, that was gnarly! Okay, last one. We got 10 minutes to search this last one. And this is the one he's gonna be in, huh? Ah! What was that? Woohoo! There we go. Oh, hey. Fish in a barrel. For sure, though, dude. Easy mode. We'll climb the ladder. Rednick's heading out the back. Oh. What the freak? Oh, he went to the last building. Somebody on the roof. Can I get in from the roof? I can. There we go. Let's kick down the door. Breach. He's got a fetching shotgun. You're done. See ya, buddy. We need kill confirmation. Bring up the camera. <laughs> Evac 
Call for exfil. Throw smoke anywhere you want to mark the location. Somewhere I can defend from. Throw evac smoke. Can we throw it on the roof? It's an AC-130, dude! <laughs> oh, snap. It went away? Well, nuts. Where's the chopper at? I hear something. Where are you, bro? What's up with the mountains? What is wrong with it? <laughs> okay. He's out there? Okay. Woods is walking. Just parked inside the car. Okay. Board. Let's get it. We're done here, Mason. <laughs> 